<clears throat> Hi everyone, Chris Kaler here from Chris Kaler Holistic. I've had some uh, questions on YouTube and from a few clients about shungite water stones exactly, uh, how to use it, what it's good for, and, and some simple instructions. Um, ultimately, with shungite water stones, you want to put them in a glass container. Please do not put them in a plastic container. What's going to happen is the shungite is going to pull the toxins out of the plastic. So uh, any kind of glass type container will, will do. Um, so, so once you've done that, uh, you're going to want to let these uh, water stones sit in the water for, uh, for a good three days. If you want optimal uh, healing properties within the water, three days is, is, is optimal. Uh, if you sit one to two days, it's going to detoxify the water, add some nutrients. But if you want the, the, the uh, energy healing properties, three days is, is best, 72 hours. Once that's done, Pour yourself a glass of Shungite water. Uh, the, the taste, you're hardly going to notice the taste at all. Some people, if you're sensitive, you might notice it. So what do you do with this stuff? Now you've got this, this uh, wonderful water, and it's got all these properties to it. So one thing you can do, if you're energetic, if, if you have some crystals, you can take a, a nice quartz crystal wand, or any kind of crystal for that matter, point it to the water. Now you're going to give the water intent. Uh, if you have chronic headaches all the time, you can say, neutralize, eliminate, remove my headaches, you just give it intent, uh, enhance my liver function, detoxify my kidneys, Wh whatever you, you need to do, you can ask the water to do it, and after a period of time of using the water like that, it, it's going to help you in, in, that, in that area, okay? Um, you can also just take it, hold it, run your own energy into it, like Reiki or Quantum Touch, that type of thing. Uh, so, so there, there you have it. That is shungite water stones, and, and uh, the the nice thing about this stuff, it's inexpensive. It's a great way to add minerals and nutrients to your water. So, if you're using distilled water, but you're missing the nutrients, you can use a shungite to put it back in your distilled water. If you're using well water, you can use a shungite to pull out any excess uh, um, metals, uh, any uh, toxins out of the water. It's going to pull it out, okay? And you may even see a settling uh, within the water container uh, of the toxins being settled. Uh, I hope that answers your question for, for Angie. I hope that answers your questions. Um, feel free and, and uh, send me an email. And ask me anything you want about Shungite. Uh, if I don't know the answer, I'll, I'll find it. And, and uh, I've worked with it so much that I just know the, the uh, what it can do and, and its purpose. ChrisKaler.net is my website. Have a look. You can buy Shungite on my website. I, I carry pyramids. I carry spheres. I carry water stones, pendants. Uh, it, it's all there. Uh, please have a look. And if you have any questions, feel free and send me an email. This is Chris Kaler. Take care.